Kids are better than one, or so they say. A rare two-headed turtle hatching in Massachusetts. Researchers found the turtle, or turtles, on Cape Cod. Now it's living in a wildlife center while they do all sorts of studies on it. Our cameras got the first inside look. Here's CNBC's Perry Russell. Every year, about 5,000 animals are taken to New England Wildlife Center. What showed up two weeks ago on Cape Cod had them seeing double. When she lifted the lid, I, my brain just couldn't quite process it right away. It was a diamondback terrapin with two heads, six legs, and one shell. Do you find yourself wondering what you know pronoun to use for it, they, them? when you're describing a two-headed turtle? This is the first for us, you know? We are trying our best to treat them as individuals. The turtles are about the size and weight of a quarter. Seven grams today. They've been named Mary-Kate and Ashley. An x-ray shows inside, it's a full house. A barium study found they have separate stomachs. They're both doing really great. Is that surprising, how well they're doing? I, I think so. I was worried about, because we don't know what's going on internally. Uh, do they share a circulatory system? Do they share lungs? The diamondback terrapin is a threatened species in Massachusetts. Volunteers are protecting their nesting sites on the Cape, and that's how they found this one. What questions do you have going forward with this animal? So going forward, um, my biggest concern is quality of life. Um, do they have enough internal structure to be able to keep surviving like this? The turtles have bicephaly, a condition causing two heads, rare, but not unheard of. What is unheard of is that this guy seems to be thriving. Greg Mertz runs the Wildlife Center. The most surprising thing is the interest. <laughs> to me, that's, it's fascinating, and I think it's great. I think it's absolutely a positive response by the public to be interested in these kinds of guys because it means they're aware. Oh, and they are aware. Ripley's Believe It or Not has called. So has a game show in Korea. Next week, the Turtles are getting a CAT scan to see how many hearts they have. Still not clear if it's male or female or if they are male or female. Just a little bit early for that show. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.